Hey, what's up, Doc and Fam, and welcome back to Oh the Hermanity. In today's video, I am going to show you how to boost the super attack from 1 to 10 of Awakened as a Martial Artist TM. And this is an AGL unit that does turn into an LR unit, and we'll go over that in a second. But before we get started, if you guys enjoy my videos, be sure to show some love by clicking that like and subscribe button. And if you want to make sure you never miss a new video upload from me, give that notification bell a click as well. So, real quick, let's look at what this unit can do. So these are the stats right here, guys. Let me turn that on for you. Boom. So these are the stats right here. Now, obviously, this is not a summonable unit. This is a unit that you get from the World Tournament as a prize, okay? So if you're wondering where this unit is, you don't have him yet, you haven't seen him yet, you haven't done a World Tournament, that's why. So start grinding those tournament medals because <laughs> you're going to need some. But anyways, so this unit right here, this is his base SSR form. Uh, leader skill, all types, attack, and defense plus 50%. Uh, super attack causes supreme damage with a rare chance to stun the enemy. And then his passive skill, attack plus 5,000 when key is 8 or more. And defense plus 5,000 when key is 11 or more. And then once you go through the process of bringing this unit to the LR level, he turns into Unwavering Bond, TN, and Chaozu. And his stats actually get pretty beefy. So his leader skill goes from 50% to 100%, so all types attack and defense plus 100%. Uh, he causes colossal damage with a rare chance to stun the enemy, and then obviously if you get his, his key meter all the way filled past 12, he causes mega colossal damage with a chance to stun the enemy. So always being able to stun, in my opinion, is a great skill to have. Um, so as an LR unit, that's a pretty good skill for him. And then his passive skill, attack plus 10,000 when key is 8 or more. Defense plus 10,000 when key is 11 or more. Plus an additional attack and defense plus 10,000 when key is 14 or more. So it's always going to be in your best interest to get that key meter filled up as much as possible. To not only take advantage of that passive skill, but also to change um, the super attack from rare chance to just regular chance to stun the enemy because obviously obviously if it's rare chance it's not going to happen as often however before we can get to the lr level <laughs> we get a boost the super attack of this unit from one to ten and there's actually a lot of units that can boost the super attack of this tn um but what we're going to do is go over the drop units first so let's the, the first drop unit is this one right here Beyond Limits TN, and this is a unit that you can get every single week when his banner comes back, the Full Hotted Fighter. And what's great about this drop unit is I believe it only costs 7 stamina to run the event, so if you have at least 100, you can run the event quite a few times and get a lot of this unit. However, the only problem is that this unit drops in the SR form, and um, SR form isn't really an issue the only issue is, is that if you're trying to boost the super attack it's only going to be a five percent chance so let me go right here real quick let me go into training uh let's pull up tn there he is click on training partners and as you can see uh these are all ssr forms but down here we got tn uh, on the bottom right at his sr form and it's only five percent so you're going to have to boost this unit. You're going to have to spend some metals and zenny to get it to at least 50%. Um, and the reason why I say 50% is because in order to get this unit to 100% chance, you have to then TUR. So you're going to have to TUR this unit, um, and it's going to turn into this one right here, which is Martial Artist Honor TN. And then once you TUR that unit, you're going to have to UR that unit. So now you can see this is the UR level, and that's the only way you can get a 100% chance. And the reason why I don't recommend that is because you don't really want to be wasting your Turtle and Bulma medals. So let's click on him real quick. Um, as you can see, you need seven of the Strike medals, but you need also seven Turtle medals and seven Bulma medals. Now, I have a lot of them because I've done a lot of world tournaments and I buy them from the Baba shop. But if you don't grind out the tournaments or you don't buy them from the Baba shop, it's probably gonna be very rare for you to get these medals and it's not gonna be worth your time. And, and in my opinion, you're better off just getting all those strike units um, maxed out first. But we can save that for another video. So 50% is all you need to do. So what we're gonna do real quick is go down to that 5%er 
which is right here. So this is the TN and the SR form, and we're going to get him to SSR. So we need 20 Gregory medals, 10 Grandpa Gohans. Uh, I believe this is three. It's always hard to read some of these. Uh, yep, no, five. Five Corrin medals and then one Kibito Kai. I hate how this arrow always covers the top when I make these videos. Sometimes it's three, sometimes it's five. Whatever, it's five this time. Let me make sure. Yep, it's five. Okay, so once you have all those medals in, it's only going to cost 560,000 zenny. Let's do a quick Z Awakening. Boom, there we go. SSR level. So now what we're going to do is we're going to start trying to boost that super attack. So let's go back to training. Uh, let's find LRTN. They all look the same. It's, it's difficult to make sure you grab the right one. So now that we have LRTN right here, uh, we are going... Let's just make sure really quick. <laughs> let's just make sure really quick that it is the LRTN. Okay, that's what he looks like because <laughs> that would be terrible if we did the wrong one. It would be very embarrassing for me. <laughs> All right, so here we go. We got LRTN right here. Uh, and if we click on training partners, you obviously already know that this one gives you 50%. Um, but the other TNs that you get that are quite common when you guys are summoning on pretty much any banner, uh, if you scroll down, we have this one right here, Strength of Trust TN. And when he is in the SSR form, he turns 50%. Uh, any of these that are SR, uh, Aura Unleashed TN, if you were to get him to SSR, it would be 50%. Uh, we have some more down here. We have Respect to the Strong TN. Again, once in SSR form, 50%. And then we have two more physical ones. We have Lightning on Slot TN. Uh, and then we also have Proud till the Last TN. So all these units can be brought to the SSR level and become 50% chances. These ones are just the easiest because they are they are drop units. So let's do three at a time, which is what I always do. One, two, three. And then he's already max level, so we're just gonna click begin. Oh, uh, plus one got shafted. Let's do it again. This is why I do plus three, because you'll never get a plus four or five. I've never gotten one, but I do commonly get a plus three. So that's why I do three at a time. It's the easiest way to not waste all of your all of your drop units. If any of you guys have gotten a plus five with 50% units, let me know in the comment section. I don't think it's possible. Uh, okay, so now we're quickly running out of TNs. <laughs> one, two, and then I think I have a, one more down here. There he is. Confirm. Come on, give me a plus three. Again, plus one. All right, so as you can see, it does work. We've got at least up, went up plus one every single time. And then the event is not here right now, but when it comes back, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to grind this unit out. I'm going to get his super attack to 10 from doing it this way. And then this is an LI unit. So you have the choice of... Opening up all four hidden paths for him, so you need five in total, the first drop and the four hidden paths. And then if you get a sixth one, and you want to get that unit to super attack 10 by doing this exact same method, and then bring them both to the LR level, you can combine them, LR, uh, super attack 10 and super attack 10, and combine them for that total of super attack 20, which is what LRs get. So you can do this whole character for free without spending any Elder Kai's. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to show some love by clicking that like button. And as always, more good stuff coming soon. See you guys.